Welcome back with it, and welcome to Main Stage 2019 Super Smash Brothers Melee Top Eight. We are Toph and Scar. An enlightening Scar conversation. Yes, about Martha. About Martha. God, meantime. you know that was the crazy thing is how much we talked about Martha during that break. Yeah. God, really got so much underneath the the issues. The issues. The issues. The sword. The cape. The tiara. A lot of it has to do with the sword, as it turns out. A lot of it. Yeah. The tiara actually doesn't come into play at all. Not too much, right, but the rest mostly... has to do with his grab range toe. <sighs> Get over here, monster energy drink. I was doing a thing. Took the camera off me. Yeah, they did. No, that's right. A minute ago. That's fine. It's okay. It wasn't that important. It's fine. No, it's fine. Pew Pew you Zane. Dude, look at, his, uh, look at Pew Pew's. Look at Kevin. Young Kevin Toy's new look. Why is yeah. he swagged out like that? I know why. Because he's so sick. Dude, uh, yeah, PewPew actually got here beating Ty in like the most nail biter, crazy Martha I've seen in my life. Uh, but here's Zane. I mean, you know, the funny thing was during Zane's come up, actually, PewPew very practiced in Martha for a long time. Really liked the matchup, and he was beating Zane in tourney like over and over and over, even as Zane was getting good. But finally, I think Zane. Oh, that's a dangerous ledge level. Yeah, finally, I feel like you know now comfortably Zane has settled into that top five, top six player skill level. And uh, it does feel like this is going to be a little bit of an uphill battle for Kevin Toy, PPU. But certainly not undoable. Ouch! Answering right back with yeah. that tipper forward smash. Tied up. Tied up. Oh! Yeah, but stage positioning is so important in this matchup, right? I feel like if you have your back to the ledge, like a lot of a lot of characters, Fox, you know, Falco, like they have crazy stuff they can go up the ledge. I feel like if Marth is on the ledge, especially in a ditto, it's like really spooky, right? Mm -hmm. You don't want to get your back pushed to the ledge. Like having center stage is so, so important. Oh! Zane. Yeah, just missing a little bit in the dash dance. Mm -hmm. I love that Marth's back air can turn him around. One of the, I guess, two characters who could do that. Marth is just blowing away. Like, yeah. Oh, that could have oh, been no. it, but I Oh, Ouch. the answer's back! The turnaround. Yeah, people be laughing about it, though, not too. He knows he was overextending a little bit. You know, sometimes they're like, yeah, you're right. Tried to tell a joke, it fell flat. I yeah. was reaching a little bit. I get it. <gasps> and that's, yeah, it's going to be up. Yeah, really interesting forward air by Zane. I wonder what he was, uh, maybe counterplay against down tilt or something, but. Yeah. Oh, Ouch. my God. Dude. Ouch. Ouch. Yeah, that hurts. That's, really a, that's a free stop. a little confused that Pew Pew was staying on the ledge that long, but maybe he was thinking, there, oh, no, wow, that was so dead? sick. No, he's not dead. Wow, the down hurt misses. That was honestly so filthy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, going for another ledge cancel. I'm seeing stuff I've never seen before. I was, oh, look at the edge cancels. Zane calmly thought of as like the edge cancel king when it comes to Marth, the prince of the edge. But uh, yeah, you. Oh, can you get a KO off this? That was just so. That forward smash by Pupi was just so barely misspaced. Yeah. Oh, he tried that super yeah. duper omega yeah. sweet spot it to the maximum of the next dimension over. Yep. The, the, so worried about I getting hit, and he was just going for the pixel perfect ledge grab. Yeah, because you want it. That, that's the thing, right? You, you're getting threatened by the, the other Marth from the stage. You want to do your up B in such a way that they can't hit you with like a down uh -huh. top forward smash. So you try to do it. You know, you can make it hard for them by being a little bit lower, a little bit to the left. But he was too, or to the right if you're on the right side. The other thing you can do that you, what you'll see them do as the set goes on, and, and already people you're doing a little bit, is when you do the really quote unquote bad up B, you do the early one to catch them off guard and throw off their timing and maybe clip them as you're, as you're trying to recover the up B, but of course they call that out. So yeah, Zane again with stage control. Yeah, and a big punish from the opening. Wow, 88% just from I think like one or two openings. Ouch. Ouch indeed. Hey, oh wow. People you opting to go back to Battlefield, it's called the Salty Runback. <laughs> I missed the phrase Salty Runback. We stopped saying that as a community. Yeah. So like, yeah. I really like them because I feel like it is somewhat of a statement where it's just like, you know what? I uh, I feel that that last game, I just wasn't playing my best. Right. And this game, I will outplay you. I will just play better. Yeah, it wasn't really the stage. Just like, oh my god, Zane is going all the way out there. Wow, was he looking to grab the double jump? That would have been so oh. sick. if Because he, he did time that uh, that Nair a little bit late. Maybe he was looking to catch a double jump at the very beginning, nip it in the bud. Yeah, see it. But Zane up a game and two stocks. Yeah, it's crazy how, you know, it feels like this game, you know, last game, PP was some big drops. Yeah. This game, PP was making fewer mistakes, but Zane is also just kind of outclassing him. Yeah. There's the edge guard, though, for PP. And this is the kind of match where it's super easy to make a comeback, I think, overall. Ooh, up throw there, up throw in the corner. Oh, can that you get the KO? That is a brutal tournament, tournament winner. 
Oh my that god. That down tilt is filthy. Dude, you, the sickest thing about that is that Zane, of course, I mean, as a Marth expert himself, he tracks that PPU has his side B boost. So he waits a little bit because he knows, you know, and there's PPU now with a sick combo. A lot of damage already. But is it too little, too late? Yeah, he's got to stop the bleeding right now, though. Yeah, he's going to need to take this stock without taking too much damage. Oh, Ooh, wow, I wow. love that turnaround into back air. Back, air, back yeah. air is a little bit stronger. Yep, if you get the tipper hit. Yeah, Zane was doing that earlier this game, too. I love how much these two, in particular, steal from each other. I, I use the word steal very liberally. You know, like, yeah, obviously, yeah. they're super duper Inspired good friends. Inspired. Oh! That was actually incredibly smart. I've never seen that before. <laughs> that was so creative. Yeah, that just for so me the other way. Yeah. Oh, and that's good. Yeah. yeah, I like that Pew Pew went for it because if he gets that tipper forward air, I think that that might just be right in the down air. Uh-oh. Mm, uh-oh. Yeah, uh-oh. That is going to do it. Oh, my God. For yeah, good Zane's just way too clean right now. That's kind of Zane's thing is like, man. And after that really, <laughs> really long uh, Axe Hungry Box set, here we are at game three. Yeah, this is wild. lead by Zane. I feel like we just got back from break six we, and a half minutes ago. I feel like it's been less than six and a half minutes. I feel like it's been four minutes and 45 seconds tops. I would bet on me here, but I'll take the over. I'll take the under. All right. You, know, you take the high go road. Go back. I take the low road, and I'll get to... How's that sound? Anyway. I have no idea. Game Fine. three! Final <laughs> decision. That no jump here from Zane. I saw it with my quirk. Yeah, Tope is actually incredible at uh, knowing if someone oh, jumped. That yeah. was really smart by PewPew. You definitely scared the bejesus out of Zane. <laughs> he was like, bejesus. you know what, I'm done. Yeah. Can he? No, yeah, Zane a little slow to confirm there. Wow. Wow, this has just kind of been, you know, this is actually very reminiscent of that game one where I don't feel like Zane's really getting outplayed. I feel like he just made slight miscalculations uh -huh. and lost the stocks for it, which is exactly what you want if you want to get back. That, okay, never mind. I was going to say the sickest recovery I think I've ever seen, but I guess Zane's just ready. Level. Yeah. Uh-oh. Yeah, and by the way, if there's one guy that will like... No jump. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that, that second down tilt. That, that's what I mean. Like, if you could hit them with the up B, of course. Ouch. It's going to stagger their timing a little bit. Wow, he take the, take the uh, up air down, smash the edge down. Yeah, takes. and then Zane reacts. And all of a sudden, this is a tie game. Wow. Yeah, this is super, duper solid from Zane. Coming back from like kind of unfortunate self destructs. Yeah, I think, you know, you call it self destructs. I like what you said first, which is just out strategize, right? And just like a tactical, like strategic, like it just didn't, it, miscalculation. Didn't pan out. Yeah. yeah miscalculations. Yeah, yeah. And I think that like. Oh, wow. That, was and that wasn't a tipper? Like, I'm kind of surprised. Okay. That's just the, the threat of the forward smash. Zane drops so low because he really doesn't want to get forward smash there. His recovery drops too low. Oh, I thought that was uh, going to be maybe another forward or like a dash attack maybe. Wow, crouch cancel grab just like that. And again, Zane's down tilts are just so sick. T wow, 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 wow. One pixel that people you could have landed on with that up B. Yep. Oh. Trying to wait on the uh, side. <laughs> These guys are just taking turns trying to edge guard each other in the most brilliant ways, but like almost too brilliant. Almost. That is that's finally gonna be it, right? Yeah, yeah there's no, there's no, just no way. Yeah, no no gas All left right. in the tank. Pew Pew definitely is up percent, but this could be his last game and winners. Wow. Yeah, with the oh, but Zane kind of Zane going for something. Another oh, down tilt. Those down tilts. Why, why are his down, down tilts so filthy, dude? A lot. Well, so what? What he I think a lot of Marths do. Tilt. Yes. What a lot of Marths do, and I, I actually haven't really seen this before. That was one of the first Marthos sets where it really came into prominence. Most Marths will try to space around the up to not get clipped, and then try to time the down tilt. Right. Zane's taking the Zane hit. is actually going all the way in, like next to the ledge, and he's crouch canceling the up, uh, the up -y. And then down tilting after the crouch cancel, which I think is like you're not going to get the strong hit of down tilt. You're going to get the inside hit most of the time. But that's fine. So they don't fly smart, but that's fine, right? Because he gets another mix up off that, and um, and I think he's just playing the the the, the punish after that situation happens mm -hmm. really really well. Wow! Wow! That was right. a super quick set. Yeah, both oh, comments. Look at this. Oh, F smash. I thought it would be detail. It might be switched. Yeah, it might be. Well, 
I feel like Zane's most common kill move was down tilt, but whatever. Uh, what are you going to do? Openings per kill, Kevin. I can't see yeah, how QB many because really, of your flip flops. He really wants us to not know how many. He's really Is embarrassed about it, maybe. He's like embarrassed. Yeah, he's, like, hiding it. he's hiding it. He's hiding it. I had so many right. or so few You're openings right. per kill. I don't know which one's the bad one because I haven't really thought about that metric and how I guess openings per kill. I guess you want that to be low because it means you're calming the, the mess out of them. Yeah. Zane, total damage done much lower. Uh, much lower, yeah. <laughs> yeah, just this. crazy efficiency by Zane, honestly. Yeah. Man. Yeah, and people are just super embarrassed about his. Looks like it might be the number seven. I'm not sure. Might, might be. I don't know. That means that winner's finals is going to be Zane Hungry Box. Uh, that's a classic. That's, been, that's a 2018 it's becoming, classic. It's, it's becoming, becoming a classic, classic. yeah. Uh, very that's, quickly. That's how I feel about, um, that's how I felt about, um, well, I don't know. I was going to make how like a music reference. That's, gonna, that's how I was going to feel about, like, I was going to say, like, a band name, like, uh, Moments pass.